So it's time to bring in high rises. It's time to bring in bigger buildings because uh, I mean that's just the point that we're at. I could continue to kind of spread the city, but um, there's not that much land that I really want. There's a few areas that I'd like to expand towards, but let's start building buildings. This will also help with the background problem, which uh, background problem is that there's still not that many people working in the crappy jobs. And uh, that's just kind of what needs to happen in a city. People need to work in crappy jobs. I don't know what to tell you. I'm, I'm sorry, but uh, you guys need to work in crappy jobs. So it's uh, this is how we do it. This is how we're going to do it. We need to bring in more people into the town. There's actually people leaving the town because I've been blowing up a lot of houses. Um, yeah, sorry about that. I'm sorry about that. I actually might remove this commercial. We don't need this commercial. We definitely need high density commercial. I, but I've always had a problem with the uh, these commercials at the end of the blocks. It looks weird. It definitely looks weird. So, um, here we go. Let's let's just we can always just use the uh, this tool here. Get rid of all that, and we're gonna put it right by the beach first. All right. So there we go. All right. So let's watch people pour in. Because people are going to begin to pour in right now. And I guess we might as well do the same thing here. Alright, so there we go. Let's do the same thing there. Fill this out completely. I know that we have some structures there. We've got little, you know, bike roads heading back in. This should keep most of most people satisfied for now. I might do a little bit... Actually, no. We've got, like, zero demand for residential at the moment. Hey, what's going on? Oh, sun rising. I was like, is there a power outage? What's going on? Because everything just... Oh, there is. Okay. <laughs> is there a power outage? No, that can't happen. And then bam. Hey, wait, what are you talking about? How is there a power outage? Looks like everything's fine with me. To me, it looks okay, but all right. Uh, let's build this out. Let's just have this come straight out here. Up the mountain a little bit. Away from the pollution, though. If we can help it, yeah, let's make it away from the pollution. So yeah, these power plants should work, obviously, much better. And I'll, I think I'm going to start to eliminate slowly uh, Windmill Island. We're going to have to get rid of Windmill Island. That's not going to work anymore. Also, keeping our beaches clean of, uh, of the power lines will be nice, because right now there's still some power lines. Uh, what? Oh, that's, that's why, that's why the power outage, that's why the power went out. Okay, so I'll delete you. How much money do I have? I've got money. We're losing money because whole power outage thing. Yeah, this looks so messy. So I think what I might do even, uh, how much do these cost? 80,000. That's not that bad, even though I'm losing like 2,000. Can I fit another one in there? Also, is this going to be bad because it's next to pollution? Is that is that going to affect how the world works? We could always go up further up the mountain. Okay, so we've got like some pretty high stuff. Um, I can keep these guys, or I could relocate them. I don't know if I should delete them. Oh, I, I don't think I even can. You know what might be cool is if we relocate them. Oh, there's no wind over here. Well, there is wind over here, though. That'd be a huge power line. I don't want them to be near this beach. Oh, here we go. All right, then let's do that a little bit. Not not too much. I'm not going to do it all right now, but we'll do a few. And then I'll just have, like, a little power line come and connect. This is where most of our power will be taken from. Let's just do like, I don't know, there should be like a mass migration of windmills because we've, there's so many windmills. I'm going to try to delete those, those ones on the island though. I don't need those ones on the island. I mean, I guess I could throw them somewhere in the corner, but yeah. All right, so this is, this is going to work well. We just need more people, which this, this area desperately needs higher density residential because that's going to fix a lot of the, the problems. That will definitely fix a lot of the problems. Come on, guys. Move in there. I need you to move in there so it doesn't look as as weird. Uh-oh. Abandoned building. People are not showing up. How is uh, how's traffic doing? How is traffic? Well, it's nighttime. This is where most of... Yeah, this is... Uh, it's not as bad as it once was. 
It was much worse before, and that might have been because there's a lot of construction buildings moving in because I was really building out this part of the city. But uh, let's also take a look at public transit as we wait for the daytime, daytime to arise. Nice. Holy moly. All right, so I've got like 350 people using the bus lines, um, 600 people using the metro. I'm sorry, the trams. And then, yeah, about almost 250 or over 250 people using the metro. I wish more people used the metro. There must not be. A, I mean, maybe it's a good thing. Maybe it's because we've just provided them the, the, the I guess, the, tra the fast transportation through the trams, the rail cars. I don't know if that's what they if that's what they want to do. So that that should be helpful. These things are going to be really impacted, though, as soon as we get more people into the town, which should be happening any time now. We'll get up to, I think, 20,000 people pretty quickly just just by putting in more uh, higher density stuff. How's land value, too? Should the... I'm thinking the land value should skyrocket. Oh, yeah, it's really nice right here. Yeah, very nice land value here. Hmm. So, yeah, this stuff should, boom, easily skyrocket to uh, their, their, their highest level. This is where things are going to get look really cool. Man, I wish I could just... There's a first-person mod, but it... I don't know why. Whenever I try it, it, doesn't, it didn't work, so... First-person, like, bike riding would be amazing. Yeah, and then we're going to be able to get rid of these power lines soon enough. But we've got more than enough electricity for a while, actually. For a long time. So offices are going to be interesting too. So the industry is still going to continue to tick up. There's no like high density offices or anything like that. The offices are already pretty much high, dens uh, high density. So what I think I'm going to do is we're probably going to have to, we d probably don't have a choice. We've got to build the ore industry out this way. Uh, one thing I want to mention, I and I do definitely plan to bring a small, small like little village out this way. Just want to throw that out, throw that out there. I think that, that that would look so cool. So a small village will eventually be here, but uh, for now, we're gonna we're gonna have to wait on that. I still really like the what what I did with this highway. Hopefully, I can do something like that similarly again. Similar again. This is like my favorite part of the town. This this old this very quiet area, but uh. It doesn't look very good, does it? I mean, there's nothing really going on over there. Hey, nice little boost up. Another thing that I could do is get a police headquarters. I have no headquarters at all. We've got small stations everywhere. But a headquarters probably in the downtown area is is going to be needed. Let's check on some of the policies. So, of course, I'm trying to boost recycling. I think I might get rid of schools out. Well, let's wait. Let's wait till we get more buildings in. Harsh prison sentences. I don't think we have a criminal problem at the moment, so I'm not going to do that. Taxation. Let's do tax relief. Release. Relief for high density. Yeah, lowers it by 2%. I want people to move into our buildings a little bit more. Just to get that moving quicker. So let's do that. Let go, for sh uh, let go of leisure. Leisure specialization areas stop generating tax income. But uh, get a hefty boost in their entertainment and uh, attractiveness values. Not yet, not yet. Yeah, I don't, I don't think so. So the tax relief should have these buildings. I, they're pretty, they're pretty much already ready, ready to go. High rise ban. I'll, I'll do that. I should probably do that in some areas, like over here. But I, I'm not gonna. Yeah, we'll see. High tech housing. Industrial space. Allow industry to work even more effectively effectively by overlooking a few... Ooh. Doubles the amount of goods produced by industry buildings. That might be kind of fun. No one's really working in, in our in our industry, though. I love the like the birds chirping and stuff like that. Since we're by the mountain. That's cool. Okay, so I need to do more. I need to do a lot more here. Boom, boom, boom. Alright, so let's do that. And then let's slap these suckers down. I've got, you know, a lot of little things inside there already. Throw these kind of small. Yeah, get all this stuff out of here. We don't want this stuff anymore. Sorry. We don't want you anymore, though. And I'll paint you guys in. 
All right, so the public transit system sh we should be displaying some numbers that I've never, I'm, I've, to be honest, I've never really seen these numbers before already because I've, I, I usually am so, I don't ever think about public transit. It's usually like in the single digits, double digits maybe. The fact that everything is in the triple digits is uh, pretty awesome. Higher education. Yeah, so where am I going to put more commercial at? Because if anything, I kind of want to get rid of the commercial here. And just do this entirety, entirely residential. Because I don't like that there's commercial. I think this should be, the Maple District should be something kind of quiet. I don't know what this would do, but let's go ahead and, uh, no, let's not do it. Let's stop. Because I'm trying to get people to move into the, to the high density stuff. I'm glad that we gave them the tax relief. The tax relief now is... We did that in the, like, the exact right time that we needed that. Make sure you... Yeah, there we go. Let's paint this back too. Alright, so yeah, where are we going to put this commercial stuff at? This high density commercial. I'm thinking in one of these pockets here. I think it's got to come in, in one of these pockets. Let's, yeah, I guess so. Let's start off in the middle. Let's start it off in the middle. Again, I'm kind of being more conscious about the noise. Like, I don't, I don't want it to be like this, just, ah, like crazy stuff happening. People listening to corn and System of a Down while you have, like, old people, like, right next to them just chilling, just trying to live their last days. And then you've got, you know, these headbangers. I mean, that would totally be me, but I'm just saying, I, I'm, I'm trying to think of the old people, too. Okay, so that, that should help out for a little bit. Should I give them a tax relief too? The uh, high density commercial? Maybe. Yeah, let's go ahead and do it. Let's let's do that too. Whoops, that's the wrong tab. Taxation, small business enthusiasts. I'm just looking at the other things too. High tech housing is always fun, but we'll see. I'd like to put that in the Maple District. And then Old Town in the other area. Tax relief for high density. There we go. Tax relief for high density commercial. Tax relief for high density. Is this the same thing? I can I can do it twice. It looks like it. Commercial, residential, yeah. Huh. So I can do like a 4%. I could really push them. Well, yeah, let's not do that yet. City planning ban I could ban bikes on the sidewalk because I know that more people are, are being injured that way I don't think that's going to be an issue for now but I bet you it becomes a, a bigger issue for sure in the future okay so I'm going to select this and we're, we're going to do that we're going to do high tech high tech housing so that'll be cool so yeah they should all kind of upgrade land value here is going to just go crazy it's going to go nuts yeah I'm going to bite the bullet and do this Bite the bullet and do this. Let's put residential here. Okay, cool. So these should be some really sexy houses. I mean, I... There's really only... Because there's a few spaces, actually, that I know that I'd, I'd want to build out for, for more area. This is more industry, more residential. I'd like to go underneath the highway. I could also do another forest industry over this way. I mean, I've already done that underneath the highway. I just need to buy this tile, and I can put a lot more houses there. We don't need that at the moment, though. Let's check on traffic real quick. Good, so people are using... It just depends on the time of day. This goes back and forth, but I'm glad I did that. Dang, I created like a really huge off-ramp, and uh, it's, still, it's still packed up in here. You know what might be better? Here, let me try this. Let's, uh, let's delete this for a second. And let's make, turn this into, I don't know, not a medium-sized road. A small road won't work either, though. No, 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 actually, yeah, a small road that goes one way. And just to, you know, I'll give them some trees, too, if they want some trees. Now, this way, theoretically, I don't know if this is going to work, actually. Yes, that's, yes, it is working. That's what I wanted. I wanted to make sure that people could stack in here a little bit better 
Most people are trying to turn left, though, it looks like. I'm sorry, right. They're right. And that makes sense. I mean, this is where the commercial and the industry and things like that are over. What I can do is uh, I could just extend this. I can't upgrade this stuff. Well, we'll keep that in mind. I could turn it into, well, let's try one more thing. Let me try just, oh, there's no one-way mediums. There are, there are these big ones, though. Uh, that's not going to work. I don't do that, Drew. Okay, don't, don't do that. I mean, the thing is, there are kind of bigger cars, too, that are coming up. Hmm. Is this okay over here? Yeah, this is fine. How about this? Now, I know that we have a big problem. Yeah, right here. I knew that. So, this might be a better option to try out for the maybe six lane one ways. Hmm. Why is this not going to let me let me connect? I don't exactly know if this is going to be the most efficient. It's it's definitely going to fill people what it, what it, I, and this is also helpful to see like what people are trying to actually do. I don't know what's going on. Everyone's trying to turn left. So yeah, this is so everyone's trying to go to the offices. No one's really trying to go home. Hmm. Uh, another thing that I could do and stop this, get the off ramp and then kind of have it start from here. Here's the good thing is that there really is nobody that is, everyone that's using this highway is just trying to exit. Nobody is, is coming here to continue on the highway. Oh, they're disappearing if they are. Oh, that's because I, I, I switched this around. How many plots of land would I need to buy? I can't even... Oh, I don't even have access to this. It'd have to be at least two or three. And I'd have to swerve around the zoo. Boom. And then connect like that. I don't know. I don't know how well that would work. Hey, no one's using this highway anymore. Let's give it a second. That 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 had happened also uh, in the northern part of our town. I feel like it's just commercial that wants to move in. It's crazy. It is just commercial. All right, well, let's get the paint tool. Let's paint you guys here. Do I want anything more? Let's let's do a little bit more like that. And then yeah, I mean, it's it's kind of tough. I hope you have the customers, man, cuz not too long ago you didn't have the customers. So, you know, don't be complaining to me if no one wants to shop in your big old building that you spent like a million dollars building. We'll see. Anyways, uh, yeah, so we've started our, our slow grind of, of getting more people into, uh, into buildings. Oh, this is looking really nice. I need to put some more of those luxury buildings to make it look less, less weird. I think this might be one of my favorite towns by the end of the series. I think that when we get more high rises up, um... I, I think that it's going to look pretty cool. I, not the not the best here on YouTube. There's some amazing creators out there that are doing some amazing things with City Skylines. But uh, for me, for you know, personal, my, my, my personal PR, I guess, personal record, um, I, I think it might be one of the best by, by the end of this. But anyways, guys, thanks so much for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.